Forces opposed to Salvaquil's government in South Sudan claim to have shot down a helicopter gunship on Sunday in the Yapanal state's capital of Malakal. But a Ugandan military spokesman has denied the reports, saying Uganda's troops in South Sudan are not involved in any combat. First of all, that's a bad lie. We do not have aircraft in South Sudan. None of our aircraft is missing. And it's very unfortunate that they can engage in such empty propaganda. We can account for all our aircraft. Local media says rebels have photographs of the helicopter wreckage. Uganda, which sent troops to the South Sudan in December of 2013, has been accused by the rebels of fighting alongside President Salva Kiir's government. They want Ugandan forces to withdraw, but Kampala insists it will only leave after a regional force is fully deployed. Well, as a regional actor that is interested in creating regional peace and stability, given the fragility of the region, and South Sudan in particular, I think it's important that we maintain presence until the eager troops can deploy so that there is no virtue. Now, fighting continues in South Sudan despite several attempts to bring the two warring sides on the discussion table. Renewed violence has seen the rebels launch large-scale attacks on Malakal, a state capital in the northeast of South Sudan. Leon Senyange, CCTV, Kampala.